let's look a little closer at Invertebrates! Spiders, beetles, centipedes, snails and squids are all invertebrates. But what does that mean? Animals like frogs, fish, snakes, lizards, tigers, zebras, giraffes, elephants, hippos, oh, and whales, ducks, and people of course. These animals have spines made of bone, or backbones. Even dinosaurs had backbones. These animals are called vertebrates. But many more animals don't have a backbone at all. These animals are called invertebrates. There are so many different types of invertebrates. Did you know that worms, jellyfish and sponges are all invertebrates? They all don't have backbones. Invertebrates like snails, slugs, octopuses or clams have a soft body and are called mollusks. Some mollusks develop a hard shell and can have a muscular foot like a snail or tentacles like a squid. Some invertebrates have a skeleton on the outside. These animals are called arthropods and they all have a tough outer layer called an exoskeleton. Arthropods are one of the most diverse groups of invertebrates. They include all of the insects, the crustaceans like crabs and prawns, the arachnids like spiders, scorpions and mites, and the myriapods, which means animals with lots of legs, like centipedes and millipedes. Arthropods grow by shedding their exoskeleton, kind of like how a snake sheds its skin. Some arthropods, like grasshoppers, shed their exoskeleton several times when they are young until eventually they become an adult. So next time you see an invertebrate, why not look a little closer? Subscribe to Look A Little Closer for more videos about little things in your garden.